Hi, in this video we're going to talk about how to install this micro SD card to the bird box camera inside this bird house. So the camera can save the live video to the micro SD card. I understand that one question may be wondering whether we need to get the micro SD card to read the card through the PC computer or not. Actually, we don't need to take off the micro SD card. We can download the file by using the mobile app or the PC software. Okay, now let's get started. First, let me just bring the bird house and to the desktop so we can install the micro SD card. There are different kind of car in the market. The camera working with most of the lighter micro SD card less than 64 gigabyte. Can we also work with the large micro SD card like the 128, even 256 gigabytes? Yes, but if you choose to use the large car like the 128 after that, you need to choose a specific brand like the Sandisk A1, the red tide. I know Sandisk, this brand, they have different micro SD card, but only the A1. Why? Because after 64 gigabytes, they have new file system in the micro SD card. And the Sandisk A1, we test it's back for work compatible, so there's no issue. Actually, you can use up to 512 gigabytes. It's quite large. And you may also wonder how much capacity we need for a camera to record for one, one date. If you just use the continue recording, you need to about 20 to 25 gigabytes per date. So if you are using like the 128 gigabyte micro SD card, probably I think it's going to record four or five days. But for the camera, you also can choose the like the motion recording. What's motion recording? So if there's no moving in the bird house, the camera may not save the live video. So it's going to save a lot of space. But the motion recording is not accuracy. It just the camera just detect a change. Even there are some fresh line or the change on the scenes, it's going to trigger the motion detection. But after all, it still saves a lot of space. Okay. This is the Wi-Fi version of the camera. And here you can see that this is the micro SD card slot, which allow us to install a micro SD card. And if you are using like this one, this is the wi not the Wi-Fi version, this is Wi-Fi version. It also has a micro SD card slot. So you, you can use the micro SD card. This is the cable, you need to go with the cable connection. And if you have the camera, which does just doesn't have this micro SD card slot, you can use this station. You see the station? Also have the micro SD card slot. You can install the micro SD card. Basically, all this equipment can support micro SD card. Okay, now let's just get the power. And okay, the one thing before we install the micro SD card, we need to disconnect the power. When the camera boosts up, it will detect the micro SD card. So if you just power up, then you install the micro SD card later. It's not going to work. The reason is the camera is not going to detect the car. So Let's just install the micro SD card before we pop the camera. This is micro SD card. You can see there's pin. You just recognize this pin. The pin supposed to face to the lens. So this is the right direction to insert, insert the micro SD card. Now we just push. I think it's ready. That's it. And the next thing is use this cover. This is 3N tape. With this cover, it's going to cover the hold and to maintain the waterproof. That will be it. Now let's pop the camera. There's nothing to do once we install the car, the camera will start recording automatically. We don't need to format the car or do anything. Okay, let's just go to the app and try to find the camera. This is the live video from the camera. Now the camera is live. And we can go to check the micro SD card. From here, you can see the local storage. The, the micro SD card is being detected by the camera and it's showing the capacity. Also, the camera already recording. Now let's go to the 
live video from here you can see the local playback this is the footage not saving to the micro SD card you can click one of the sample now and start playing the live video if you want to download so you just need to click and hold for a while you can see this the option to select the video to download this one is being choose then you can click this one it's download now the file is being downloaded to this mobile phone and you can play back and this is the download file or share share to the different platform so it's just so no need to get access to take back the micro SD card actually the car using different file even you take the micro SD card back and try to use the car reader to read it will not recognize the file you need to use the special tool to read the file all right that's all for today's video if you have any question please post it in the comment section below see you next time